Hi everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to my trying a new makeup product everyday series. Today I'm going to be trying out another product from the, I think it's new, makeup line called AF94. And this, I believe, is the more affordable version of the makeup line About Face, which is Halsey's makeup line. And I picked up the Majorly Matte Liquid Lip in the shade Sucker Punch from Walmart, where it cost 7 or $8, so a nice price point. I'm excited about the shade because I chose the hot pink. I mean, my shirt. I can't resist a hot pink color. <laughs> I'm not too crazy about this packaging, but let's see what the applicator looks like. Oh my gosh, such a bright pink. Okay, applicator seems fine. Like a slightly pointy at an angle, kind of doe foot applicator. Let's see how it smells. Oh, it actually smells sweet. It smells nice. Not like an incredible fragrance to a lip product, but it smells fine. Let's see how it actually is on my lips though. Ooh, I forgot to swatch it, but no need. This is super pigmented and opaque. The applicator is a little flimsy, like I'm worried it's gonna fall off, but I was able to get a precise enough line with this. I can feel it drying down already. Definitely a bold pink, but I knew that going into this. You know, it's drying down and it's almost looking like a little bit cracked where I have the lines in my lips. So I'm going to go over with another layer and see if that can smooth out, be opaque. Well, it is definitely matte. And I have dry lips to begin with, with a lot of lines in my lips and you definitely see that with this product. And it kind of reminds me of that kind of drying out, like very, lots of like texture, lots of lines in the lips type of matte liquid lipstick that was so popular a few years ago. And I just feel like there's better matte liquid lip formulas out there now that I'm not, trying to find something that's so dry, so textured. It is a beautiful color though, let's see. Yeah, but like when I smile and you know the lines in my lips get straightened out, <laughs> smoothed out, you can still see lines and texture in the lip, which is not very flattering and not very comfortable either. Like I feel like I already need to apply like a lip balm, lip gloss, and I just put this on. But let's see how the kiss test goes. Yeah, I would say pretty much no transfer. So it is long lasting, which I love. If I'm gonna be wearing a matte liquid lipstick that's this matte, this dried down, I do not wanna see any transfer. So that's good. And to fix that, dryness, that texture, I could just go over it with a lip topper, a lip gloss, a plumping lip gloss, and that would help. So this is okay, but I'm not blown away by it. I don't love it. And it really is kind of like paint, like a thin pigmented formula that like does not look precise enough on my lips. I definitely would need to use a lip liner with this. I just feel like I would not be comfortable wearing this like because of the feel of it comfort wise but also how it looks like i feel a little self-conscious of having this on my lips with the texture with the like uneven edges that really need to be so perfect or else it's very obvious <laughs> so yeah now i know 
If you've tried this out, let me know how it worked out for you. But as always, thank you so much for watching my video today. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day. And I will see you tomorrow in my next video.